try this and kill her out instead. Those skipped frames were annoying me. It's not like video quality is goddamn paramount in this game. Gross, a hole in the sewer. I know it's friggin' ugh. Bandwidth easy piece of shit. I know what's up. Oh, ugh. I foolishly, foolishly left my PS4 on. moments like that that make me really legitimately wish there was actually a um, Zenny counter on screen so I could see it just go up. Ah, so satisfying. They always drop a pretty, pretty penny. I remember being a child and being completely afraid to approach this monster. And then I discovered Circle Strafing. Arguably the most bullshit thing to do in this game. Oh, welcome to the stream! Matter of fact, I think most of the bosses in this game are susceptible to circle strafing. But I'm gonna try not to uh, take too much advantage of that and fight them as intended. Fuck. Oh, at least there's no smart <coughs> spark mandrel syndrome in this game. guys are actually taking a little bit more of a pounding than I'm used to them taking. 
Oh well. Not that I completely mind. Maybe I unupgraded my buster a little bit. I mean, took down its attack stat a little bit. I don't know. I don't remember doing that, but it's probably what happened. Ha! He tried to explode on me, but it didn't really work out for him. See, that's why the Japanese lost. Kamikaze is just not a very good battle strategy. Because seriously, um... Actually, I don't really want to get into World War II tactics, because I would be here all day. Because I love talking about war tactics and shit. This specific area is a really great place to grind for um, Zinni early game. Because uh, these nests here drop an obscene amount of Zinni. Especially that once you kill all the mosquito larvae therein. See, I have 20,000... 20, yeah, 20,870 right now. But after that, I have 23,000. That's pretty good. These guys drop a pretty bit too. Where's that other green bastard? There he is. Got him. And that's practically all the enemies in here. I mean, there are other ones, but they're one-shot enemies that drop maybe, like, at most five zenny a pop. And that's if they actually drop anything. Though the neat thing is that by exiting the other area, I respawned that mini-boss so I can get all those. I keep wanting to call them rupees. All those zennies again. Because straight up everything responds. Man, leave it to roll casket to come up with a useful use for a vacuum cleaner. I mean, as a digging tool. I mean, vacuums are useful when it comes to cleaning up house, I guess. I actually see a lot of people, like, online not using this sub-weapon because it doesn't do damage. What the hell's the point? Oh, well, it makes grinding significantly faster. I mean, shit, if you try to collect all those goddamn zennies by just walking into them, you're not gonna collect all of them, and they're and the shit ton of them are gonna disappear. That is literally money slipping through your fingers right there. Just 
destroying these things first, I'm sure you've noticed. Oh, um, they actually have that, dude. I'm pretty fucking certain of it. I mean, there's, uh, the, um, tournament-based shooter that was based off of Mega Man, but I think there's also a Mega Man Legends Doom hack. But you're absolutely right. That would be f fucking cool as shit. You know what? I just fucking might do that. Imagine being a kid and not expecting that shit. You would fucking shit yourself. how excited the dodge roll is and how lenient it is too up oh, he's dead ouch and he got me from the grave tisk tisk Alright, no, this is the uh, way I don't want to go. I want to go this way. For ever so slightly more zenny. here? Yes, it was. Later on, I'll be back to break down this wall. But as it stands, I can't. Also, the weapon used takes up so much fucking weapon energy, it makes it almost unfeasible to use it and just, I should wait to get the drill arm. But the shit hidden behind walls is so good that it's almost worth running back and forth to recharge my weapon energy. Man. I want more games to have this kind of feel where, like, you're digging around underground for, like, lost artifacts to up your, like, to make your arsenal better. And, like, I know games like Terraria and Minecraft do that, sort of, but those are more crafting-based, whereas this is, like, more of an adventure game. I want more adventure games to do that, you know? Alright, I should have plenty of money to upgrade the specific part I need now. For a PS1 game, this totally fucking holds up. Like, now that I'm used to the controls again, they're smooth as silk to me. But let's not ignore that Roll here is quite a cutie. Look at her. say, I'm also tempted to run with the Power Buster. 
but it's so slow. There we go. Fun fact, Wily's Boats. In this, in this universe, Dr. Wily, well in this part of the timeline, Dr. Wily didn't become a doctor at all. Instead, he became a grizzled sailor. Look at him. That's Wily. It's nice to see him as a law-abiding citizen, isn't it? Oh, welcome to the stream. Recharge energy. Save game. And now, we're about to be on a boat. This should be fun. Unless it's not. It's the boat. Call roll. Who apparently knows how to drive a boat. I suppose a boat is just a floating airship. Mega Man, are you ready? Yup, let's go. Here we go. Man, that is a lot of splashback on that boat. Those must be some powerful motors. Picking something up on the sonar. Keep an eye out, Mega Man. Knew it. They're here! Robots are here! Christ. Water battle. Protect your boat from enemy attacks. Shoot and destroy the red subs, torpedoes, and the yellow ship's missiles before they hit the ship. Mission start! Excellent. Damn it. Taking so much damage already. Mega Man, ahead. Yo, it occurs to me that this is technically a turret section. But I'm less inclined to care. What? Man, I knew upgrading this was a good idea. Don't relax yet, Mega Man. I'm getting multiple signals on my sonar. There's a lot of little signals coming from around this ship. What? Where? I don't see shit. Hmm. They're above us. Fuck. Oh. Bam. I think that's all of them. I should probably increase my range real quick. Mega Man, ahead.
This moment's actually kind of tense. Alright, how many more of these ships could there possibly be? Because I'm running real low on weapon energy. Bison on a hand basket. They're really banking on this. I don't remember if there's a cap on the uh, boats you have to destroy or if you have to just outlast it. I also don't remember if the boats save damage you do to them. Huh, a canal. It looks like we got rid of all their little ships. Wait! I can see it on the sonar! Heads up, Mega Man! Something big coming this way! Well, fuck! I knew our little blue boy'd show up. I figured we'd run into him sooner or later if we waited here. Slow ahead! Slow ahead! God, I love these guys. <laughs> They're kind of like Team Rocket and the fact that they're villains that never succeed, but god damn it, you love them. I say he should have been the voice actor for Dan Hibiki. It just sounds right to me. Why should I care if he if that little brat dies? I shouldn't. I really shouldn't. Oh Tron, you're adorable. Well fuck. Well, that doesn't appear to be doing anything. I don't know, Roll. Maybe you should go down the canal I saw earlier. Mega Man, what should we do? Fight or retreat? Uh, fight. Okay, Mega Man, hold on. Wait, I could have refilled my buster if we retreated. God damn it. Hey, canal. Ha, ah, see how you like them apples, you son of a bitch. Oh. Apparently he prefers those apples. Apples are part of his preferred diet. Yeah? You didn't fall off or anything, did you? You can hear me still shooting, you silly thing. Okay, okay, okay. They couldn't be able to maneuver in here. Why do they think they're doing running around like that? Why don't they just give up? Aim for their arms and weapons. It's nothing more than a big frog because they can't shoot. That's right. Don't we? 
Teach you to mess with Mega Man. Bitch. Get dunked on. Status report. This is the engineer reporting. A landing deck completely offline. There's flooding in the main hub. The build pumps aren't working. There are fires in blocks two and three. They're being sealed off. Teasel, I hate to admit it, but she's not gonna last much longer. And boom goes the frog. My frog. Man. Who knew purple frogs exploded, right? I'm sorry, Troy. After you went to all the trouble to make us such a magnificent robot. What can I say? Cheer up, Teasel. Okay, I'm skipping the cutscene. I I I wanna play. <laughs> That's what I want. I wonder, can I switch my weapon in here? No. <sighs> Alright, fine, I'll go back to town just so I can switch my weapon. I need something with a bit more umfa. Like that sword I worked so hard to level up. Back to Willie's boats. All right, now let's do this. I should probably re-equip my buster the way it was. Hmm. All right, Mega Man, let's get started. This is about when my memory gets a little bit fuzzy on this game. That old fellow used to have plans for world domination, I bet, because his name is Wiley. Oh shit, that does a lot of damage. Um. But it sure does make a funny noise. Thank you for locking on to the one that did not serve the biggest threat to me. Okay, I am getting just absolutely fucking creamed here.
Rice on a bike. Okay. Uh, uh, not liking what I'm seeing. Ooh, I don't like these things. They are Trey Quipe. Nope, 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 nope. Well, that didn't work. It's just faster to take him out with my buster. Every time I play this game, I remember those first times in each dungeon where I just felt utterly apprehensive and, uh... Like, this game was incredibly good at making you feel like you were digging into shit that hasn't been seen for, like, centuries. And that there was dangerous shit around because of that fact. What did you find? From these readings, it looks like a starter key. That means there's probably a big refractor in here somewhere. Well, that's good. good. Luck. Come on. These things are just annoying to deal with, really. Found a ring. Cool. What kind of ring, though? Oh. Mega Man, what can you see up there? I'm not picking up anything on my monitor. I don't know. I've got a bad feeling about this. And another star key. Excellent. Now, see. This room, this room is full of nightmares. This room is full of nightmares and lies. I'll show you why. Cause these fuckers are invisible now. And Jesus Christ. How horrifying. Wait, is that a buster part? No, okay. Oh, I do not jump high enough to get away from anything. The thing is, sometimes they can and will jump up after you. I don't know how, but they can. It's happened to me. I've had that nightmare before. And I'm just, oh. Oh, hi, Thomas. How you doing? Oh, God, crocodile sharks. Fuck! They're fucking adorable, but Jesus Christ if I'm not terrified of them already. What's down here? Hmm. 
bunch of walls that I had to break down. Oh, that's cool. What you gonna be streaming? down here for one part, and I assume the other side's gonna be the same thing. God, that room terrified me as a kid. Oh, it's fine, Alpha. Don't worry about it. Running, 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 running. Water. Oh, hey, an inconspicuous oil drum. Huh. Neat. If I'm read, we. Ah. Lower the shield, of course. Give me that thing. It's so big and pretty. The thing's worth at least 20 rupees. Suspicious ass Mega Man. Love it. Alright. I'm fully prepared for what's about to happen. I bet. Mega Man! I'm picking up a Reverbot signal. It came out of nowhere. It's a big one. The readings are going off the scale. Oh god, that barrel can fly! And it's a transformer, who knew? Yipe. Ouch! Oh, that's awesome. I love X4 streams. Fuck. It looks like you damaged it. Keep it up, Mega Man. No, I figured I'd stop halfway through the boss fight roll. Whoa. I'm trying not to circle straight bosses, but this guy makes it hard not to. Ouch. Again. Ouch. Bam. I'm not picking up any Reverbot signals anywhere. It looks like you got him. Awesome. Please no. 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 Where you can get delicious sandwiches of can you not. Wrapped in a please do not bread. Toasted to a delectable temperature of no, please. With gooey, melty, delicious, Jesus Christ, do not. Hey, 
Hey, the sword can one-shot motherfuckers. Ow. I might have deserved that. You must be getting hungry, Mega Man. I made some apricot pie. Are you up for a slice when you get back? Christ, dude. Why would you make me pie? I appreciate it, but this is not the time to tell me about it. I'm being hounded by fire-spitting reaver bots. Okay, I'm out. Now you can tell me about the pie. Please. I need the pie. Apricot, you said? That's disgusting. I'm kidding. I love apricots. Oh no, they're plotting. Who cares? <laughs> Though luckily, I won't be able. I won't have to use that boat any longer. And now Roll's gonna be like, wow, look at the size of that jewel. So they're off to fix their ship of air. And with that, the flutter is fixed. Beautiful. Oh yeah, that cat. Oh, I'm a little low on energy. Better have a drink. <sighs> now, whose room is it? Ah, this is old, the old man's room. Old bomb casing. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Deepest lore. Isn't this the freaking total pull, tone pull thing from X6? It is! It's the totem pull thing from X6! Someone get Twitch on this. As a matter of fact, I'm saving a screenshot right now. My screenshotting methods are a little archaic, so I had to put it into Microsoft Paint. But still. There we go. I assume this is Mega's room, or is it Roll's room? Yeah, it's Mega's room. First aid box. Alright. Anti quack. Meow. Man, Mega Man, your room's boring. I mean, don't you have any hobbies or interests? Seriously. At least Roll's room is cute. Fine, I'll go talk to Gramps. Oy vey. Alright, now that I've spoken to him and completely ignored everything he was saying. Uh, 
Let's go to the R&D room, please. I want you to develop me some shit, roll. Uh, here's one of my predictions, Alpha. We're going to be getting around two and a half. And by that I mean two normal sized ones and one short one. Ah, exactly what I needed. This thing needs more energy. Holy fuck! Look at the amount of money that requires! Jesus shit! Oh my god! Yeah, probably. I've got to go and be fucking sparing about my shit. I want to take the vacuum arm, but I fucking can't. Now I gotta try to remember which way leads to the place with all the shit. With those shitty breakdown walls that require the grand grenade. What's Mark's from again? I don't recall and now it's bugging me. Alright, can this be broken down with a grand grenade? Well now I fucking know it can't. So I gotta go right the fuck back up. Ah, yes, that fellow. Who doesn't love eldritch genocidal jesters, really? I mean, come on. Let's see here. Recharge of special weapons. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Actually, yeah, roll gave me an adapter for this that makes me um able to add another shit to my shit. <laughs> ah, that's the one I will be adding. And I'll go ahead and use the hyper cartridge and buy another one. Give me my hyper cartridge. Excellent. Is it just me or do genocidal jesters really seem to get very um, popular with fans of the series as they're in. I mean, you have the Joker, you have Marx, you have Kefka. I'm sure there are more, I just can't think of any. I mean, if Mega Man X had a clown in it, I'm sure everyone would be like, God damn, he's the scariest and coolest villain ever, bro. And they'd be fucking right. There's just something about clowns wanting to end the world that's just so, ah, it's so creatively compelling. I remember where I'm supposed to go. See, this is how long grinding for this shit normally takes. You gotta run through all of it with, without the vacuum arm, grinding for um, Zenny is a real pain in the fuck. Oh, shut up, you spiky-headed douchebags. It's 
through here. Now I'm shooting lemons, and apparently lemons are super powerful. That's just the truth. Lemons will save your life. It's funny to watch, I must say. Like earlier when you said Marx was gonna be the short one, I was like almost thinking you meant Karl Marx, and I was about to be like, what? Though having Karl Marx be a Mario like do, do a Mario clone would be really fucking hilarious. Man, finally. Let's see here. I'd be, I'd be careful about how I use this. Ow. And that's precisely why. Well, you're a cool son of a bitch. There we go. A treasure chest just for me. Got the old launcher. No holes in the wall. Good, good. Man, they do not have very much spatial awareness, do they? Not that I'm complaining. Let's see here. And there's nothing on the other side? Okay. Wait a second. That's literally the way that leads back to the water level. I think. Yeah, it is. How fucking clever. All the ruins in this game seem to interconnect and ooh, three treasure chesties just for me. It's a trapped box. And it's a trapped box. How fucking insulting. Oh well, still better than the mimics from Mega Man Legends 2. Wait a second. I thought so. Not what I meant to do, but now I have the jet skates. So I can get through areas much quicker. Albeit with more annoying sounds. Let's see here. Throw you right there. What? admire most about this game is that it still manages to feel very distinctly Mega Man. 
There we go. Aha! Fuck. Aha, uh -huh. that hole was worth bubkiss to me. Bubkiss, I say. That, on the other hand, was not worth bubkiss to me. And that leads back to the water level. Let me just check this wall for holes. Nope, okay. Now it's a long trek back to where I came from. But hopefully none of those freaking goddamn crab spider bots should have respawned. Ugh. Yeah, really, I gotta say, this area, well, doing this on stream is actually slightly boring because it's just everyone's seen this bit. So how about I see how much damage... Oh, man, that wrecks them. How about you, guy? Raped. Well, going up here is as good as any other place. Oh, good for you, buddy. Man, that noise isn't grating at all. Let's see. Alright, so I'm probably going to call it here, because it's been about an hour. And I'm going to, you know... Next episode, we're going to go to the next sub-gate. Or the first sub-gate. Whichever it technically is. But first, I'm going to see if I have anything for roll to make something out of. Because, fuck, I want to know. Let's see, what you got for me, roll? Nothing? Uh, I won't say you're useless, because you're not. You've given me so many beautiful gadgets. I'm the one who sucks! Come on, check that data. Alright. Well, I hope you all had a beautiful time. I sure did. I'll see you next time. Later, dudes.